Whoa! Thank you. 
There are so many things near the end of um, my early days with Atari that I wished, like everything um, we felt was underappreciated. Like I bought a Lynx and I, I was trying to find people to play the Lynx with me and everyone else had a Game Boy. And I was like, you guys, Todd Slime World, let's do this, let's play Warbirds, come on. And the Lynx was totally Sam's baby. He, he loved the notion of the hardware and Sam, I remember sitting in the room with Jack and Jack saying to all of us, let's go back, let's go back to our roots. Let's, let's do at least one more game system. The controller is quirky. The industrial design of both the CD and the main unit are quirky. And this, the fact that like, I guess somebody used the main, the tooling on the main unit to be, make some kind of dental device. Like it just has like, this weird, quirky history that I think is also inviting. One of the most interesting things about the architecture of Jaguar was this notion of having um, the Motorola 68000, which basically was responsible